Brook, flood of March, whatever it is, 15th, 16th. It's about the fourth time these people have been underwater in the last 15 years. They live in a floodplain, so I don't feel sorry for them. But uh, during Hurricane Floyd, I'd be in about five or six feet of water right now. So they got off easy this time. Let me see how, how much I can infiltrate. That guy, the photographer, just told me that was that's the high water mark there. So, it's receding. But we're a uh, uh, quarter, maybe three tenths of a mile from the actual riverbank straight that way. So, it's a lot of water. they need. We get up on the railroad tracks. Tunnel going into the transit track there. Water's got to be, I don't know, seven, eight feet deep, I guess. Recognize the spot, Joe? Of course, TV here. Can I get up there before it gets dark and I get home? It's the end of the world as we know it. Anyway. This one goes out to my buddy Joe, out in Idaho now. Recognize this spot there, buddy? <laughs> Let's fill the people in. There's a $350 million project that's now well overpriced to try and stop flooding. And they built, you can see there, they built a berm all along there. And they raised the bridge. And I said, the only thing that bridge is going to do now is stay dry, and it's still going to flood. A complete asinine waste of hundreds of millions of dollars, because it doesn't make a goddamn difference. Because the water just flows around the berm. It isn't solid. They just put bridges over, there's ra the railroad tracks they didn't raise, so it doesn't matter. All it means is they spent like 10, 20 million dollars just to raise that one bridge. And all it means now is that during the flood, the middle of the bridge is dry. <laughs> Great work, engineers, government officials, contractors, even though I guess they're, they're just doing their job. But what the f it's absolute idiocy. You can hear all the alarms going off, probably gas detectors, carbon dioxide or something. And the whole berm, the whole berm built there and they tried to, it did absolutely nothing. <laughs> absolutely nothing. <laughs> all it means is water drains in a little slower, aka drains out a little bit slower. Well spent money. Politicians at work. Trying to defeat Mother Nature. Ain't gonna do it, motherfuckers. America. I'm smarter physically and mentally superior to 95% of you. 5% of you are my equal. <laughs> Morons. Idiots. Oh dear, what a shame it's getting dark. Otherwise, I'd uh, make the move to get up on the tracks and get to Queensland to get the other side, but I don't want to add a light. I got to truck home. Shh. Goddamn bullshit. Thank you, Mother Nature. Hasn't been dry in a year and a half here.
ride your bikes, fuckers. Well, it's spring next Saturday. Thank God for that shit. I'm ordering up. Well, I gotta race home and get dark. Almost home. Got a mile and a half from the homestead. A wee bit of a valley, a holler.